Hey guys, and welcome back to another look at the Resident Evil uh, 2 demo. Of course, we uh, took one run on the PC. Um, this time we're returning on the PlayStation 4 Pro. Um, apparently there are some like graphical options that we've got here uh, on the Pro. You can choose between like a performance mode and a 60 FPS mode. Uh, let's have a little look at that. Uh, connect to RENet. Yes. Okay. Yeah, we're going to be able to get a little bit further, I reckon, this time. Because, uh, obviously, yeah, we've already gone through the game once. I have not watched anybody else play this game, uh, this demo yet. I will do, because, fuck, I want to see other people play this game. But, not until I've had my, uh, my share of it, shall we say. Now, let's have a look. Let's have a look at the display. HDR mode I can't do because I don't have a HDR TV. Ah, looks like there's no um, option for the performance mode. Maybe that's not in the demo. So that's interesting. Is this demo going to be 60 FPS or is it going to be the high detailed 30 FPS? Please, please pick 60 over high detail. Um, how bizarre. Alright, well, I guess that's all we have. Hang on, what's this? Dynamic range and large. We've got all the good stuff. Alright, well, let's hit it up. Let's get back into it. Back to Raccoon City. The final game may differ from this demo. This demo is only playable for a one-off 30-minute trial. Bullshit! This demo can only be played online. Yep, it's the same as uh, what we got told in the PC version. See how quick this loads compared to my PC. My PC has a Samsung SSD, so that's going to be interesting. Mm, to be fair, it's pretty damn quick. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Let me just actually have some drink here. Whilst my cat continuously tries to sneak in. There we go. Need some fuel. Alright, let's hit it up. Now, I'm guessing the controls are going to be... Oh, yep. Yep, we have 60 frames a second. Cloud, yeah. I have 30 minutes, Cloud. 30 minutes to enjoy this. Oh, I'll tell you what, though. I'll tell you what, you can already see a massive... Hello? Is anybody Massive here? visual difference between this and the PC version. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Never mind. But, unlike my PC, this is performing rather nicely. All right, let's grab the bullets. Give me the bullets. Uh, open inventory. Cool. Do we need to watch this? I don't know. Holy hell, guys! Seriously. There has to be someone here. Doesn't look anywhere near as good. Never mind. Not good. Not good, Leon. Right, we can't actually skip this, unfortunately. Send reinforcements. Send reinforcements? Who? There's like me and one other guy. Mm -hmm. One thing I do need to do, guys, is turn it up for myself. Because this is seriously quiet. And we don't want this game to be quiet. Please do not use audio system. TV speakers. Max that son of a bitch out. I can't play it in the dark because I'm recording. So I have to have some seriously loud audio. You know, it has to be said. Okay, so map is on the touchpad. That's quite cool. I like that. Now. Now, I'm assuming, obviously, if you turn performance mode off in the full game, it will look massively better. Ah, very, that's 
kind of like the original game, if you remember. But you only had the one plaque to put in there. All right, let's go get our matey boy, Mr. Chopping Half Guy. I'm liking the way it controls, though. It's a lot nice. I've been playing a lot of Resident Evil um, 5 recently uh, with my partner. And it just feels a bit weird on the control pad. This, the control pad controls so far, feel very nice. Very nice indeed. And it is still a very gorgeous game. Even on the PlayStation 4 Pro. In fact, it is absolutely fucking incredible. It doesn't just... It, there's that sharpness that the PC has that it's missing. But man, it feels very nice to play. You cannot say that it doesn't feel nice to play. Evening, you zombie bastards. Yeah, we got this, Leon. Let's go have a little look down here. Ooh, now I'm... Ooh, fuck. We can look in here. Uh, wasn't this the room? Yep, yeah, we can turn the lights on. Get the lights on. Now, what was in here? Bullets. We're going to need bullets. Because getting headshots on a control pad is going to be a lot harder. Now, I know there are some people, right? Uh, I've got this friend that I used to work with. And he is godlike on a control pad, man. I, I swear he's better on a control pad than I am with a mouse. But I just can't get used to the whole sticks. For aiming, for everything else, like, the control pad is the way forwards. But for aiming, man, you just can't be a mouse. So that's the way we have to go. I don't want to miss anything. Like, look at this place. It's so fucked up. Now, how do we quick turn? So quick turn is down and circle. Alright, I like that. Me like. Very nice. Jesus. Yeah, we can't go through there. We need... I'm guessing we need bolt cutters for that. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm on it, Chief. I'm on it. I'll be seeing you a little bit later, matey. Now, we know we can actually stop and fight all these zombies. Because we did it in the PC version. Alright, buddy. I'll get you out. I got you, buddy. Ooh. Oh, 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 I like it. The Lord won't help you now. I've worked out why this doesn't look quite as nice, actually. There's a lot of, like, film grain effects and stuff that are all over the screen. And, um, like, lens flare effects that I turn off on the PC version. Come on, you son of a bitch. That's why it is. Oh, God. Come on. Up. Oh. oh, my God. Already, already sucking with the control pad. I will, I swear I will never get used to fine aiming with a control pad. Oh, it's fucking horrible. There we go. Come on, sit down, buddy. Sit down. What's reload? Oh, God, that's so much harder. Evening, Chief. Yeah, we can't get through that one. Let's just charge out of here. That way we get a little bit more time elsewhere. We can't go back down there. Oh, yeah. Jesus. Hello. Don't yeah, they are, Leon. Oh, God. One for you. One for you. One for you. Sit the fuck down, guys. Let's get a fresh magazine in here. Oh, hello, big fella. I forgot about you. Oh, popped your melon, son. All right, give me the stuff. Give me that. Uh, we will take the boards, actually, yeah. 
Why the devil not? Can we go in there? Still can't. I guess. Nope. Alright, fair enough. That's the fuse. We've got a Z following us down here, but... In the wise words of uh, my foreman, fuck him. Ooh. That does actually look like the zombie that's following us as well. <laughs> I love that. Squish. You're safe. For now. Damn, Marvin. Thanks. Marvin Brown. Leon Kennedy. But there was another officer I could. Yeah. Can we skip this? Because we we're burning sunshine. I'm sure you did we did. Does anyone know what started this? Options. Oh, we can skip. Okay, cool. Combat knife, great. Yeah, I'm actually quite impressed with how um, Capcom's been. Kind of going for 60 frames a second. It is really nice to see that. I think more games should target 60 frames a second, to be honest. Because they just feel better. You know? They feel so much better. I prefer a slight dip in visual quality to have my game play well. Especially when games aim for 30 frames a second. And they run closer to 20. Which is something that drives me mad. Let's have a little look up here. See what we've got. Any bullets or anything? Ooh, can we go through here? This should be a save room through there, if I remember correctly. Or was that the floor above? It might be the floor above. So I'm guessing there isn't actually a liquor in this demo either. Which is a bit of a shame. But holy crap, look what they've done with the police station. It looks so nice. Like the animation on Leon as well is fantastic. That's the club key. We do not need that ass of bullets. We always need bullets. There seems to be a lot of ammo around, but then if you remember to like Resident Evil 2, uh, Resident Evil 2 is probably the easiest game. And there was so much ammo, like everywhere. So, I think that kind of makes sense. But then it could also be... Oh, yeah. It could also be because they're just being generous for the demo. And I'm sure, of course, like, harder difficulties and whatnot will significantly um, dial that up even further. But I'm looking forward to seeing what the weapon unlocks are that we get later on. And the, the uniform unlocks and things like that. Because this is a game that I'm going to play the shit out of. I know, you could have had a boring day where you could have been rescuing kittens from trees and things, Leon. But no, here we are, fighting zombies. Dare I say, best first day on the job ever? A little bit disappointed that you don't see a liquor run past that window, but maybe... I don't know. I think disappointment's the wrong word. I'm not disappointed at all. I'm just surprised, I think, would be a, a better term. There's nothing here. I this guy has been like massively fucked up. But he has ammo for me. Hey buddy. Do you not have ammo? You had ammo first time when we played on the PC. You stingy little fuckwad. Oh well. Um, yeah, let's board this up. I don't know why we want to board this up. And one thing as well, this is now like the second use of their uh, Resident Evil engine. And holy crap, they've made such a like decent. Oh, that's the clock. They've made such a decent like use of this Resident Evil engine. They've really improved it since Resident Evil Seven. 
This just looks a lot nicer than 7 did. Now, 7 was a beautiful game. Don't get me wrong. 7 was lovely. Ah, shit. Probably could have boarded that one up. But, um, this one has definitely... Definitely dialed it up a notch. Oh, I forgot about you. You gotta come through, sir. Leon, chill the fuck out, mate. It's just a zombie. Come on, sir. Ooh. Son of a bitch. Ooh, I like... Oh, God. Fuck. What I like the way Leon's commenting on stuff. That's really cool. That adds quite a nice bit of atmosphere. Yeah, we can't do anything with that. We can't even, like, poke a herb out the window or something. Now, I wonder if the zombie's going to come in here again. We do want the weapon locker card. Yes. Because that allows us to get our shotgun. We like our shotgun. It's nice to see them giving you loads of ammo, though. Even if it is just for the demo. Because it allows you to have a little bit more fun, I think. Um, also, I must admit, uh, kind of like Resident Evil 7, the weapons feel really good. And they have a satisfying pop. Come on, you fucktard. I guess he doesn't want to play today. Hmm. Okay, so we've got the map of the police station, F1. Need to cut that. Do you remember the zombie? Last time we played this. He uh, poked his head through there. I really want to read these, but... I want to spend more time just exploring. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's keep going forwards. I don't know how far we can get, either. I know someone has apparently managed to do it in two minutes. This is insane, Leon. It's insanely fun. Come on, my friend. Step right up. There we go. Sit down. Sleep well, my pretty. You alive? Ooh, I f actually legitimately thought he was going to get up then. Right, let's put a fresh magazine in that bad boy. Oh, come to daddy. You're not done yet. Come on, Papa Leon's got just what you want, sunshine. <laughs> oh man, that melon burst though. Mm. Looks like apple pie. Now, what have we got in here? Can't go in there. Oh, dude. Safety deposit room, was that? Yeah, this is the one we wanted. Okay, now if I remember... Is the stuff the same, actually? Or is there a little bit of RNG? We can't go 102. 103 we can't do either, but we can do 106 and 109. 106, 109. So, 106. 109. Ah, shit. 109. Now, hopefully, they both stay open at once. I don't know where the buttons are going to be for that bad boy. Yeah, we did develop the roll of film last time, didn't we? Nice. Now, I don't know how big the bullet stack can be either. Hopefully, it can be fairly large. Because in the first game, you could stack like 200 and. Is this 250 bullets or 255? I can't remember. Something like that. It was a lot. So. Alright, let's load that sucker up. Ooh. Come to daddy. Come on, you bastard. Let's go for a body shot this time. Come on, you fucker. There we go. Ooh. Jesus. Good night. So, 203. We can't do any of the two, so that's the thing. Yeah. Oh, well. Never mind. Let's get our Matilda back out. 
We've got so many bullets, guys. Holy crap. Oh, evening. All right, who's making all that noise? Come on. Whoa. Hey, buddy. I thought I fucked you up. I mean, I did fuck you up, but obviously not enough. Good night. Sit your ass down, boy. Okay, so where are we on the map? Now, if you remember, uh, in the original Resident Evil as well, or the original Resident Evil 2, we could go to the West Office now. Uh, which is where Leon's desk is. It didn't actually tell you where you were on the map. It told you what room you were in. But it, there's a bastard in here, remember? But it didn't tell you use of gunpowder. Yeah. It didn't tell you exactly where you were in the in the room. Which was the same in Resident Evil 1, I believe. Yeah, pal. Thought you were going to get up. It's all right, Leon. We got this. We got this. Come on. Someone behind us, too. You can hear him. Okay, these zombies are actually fucking amazing. Dude, that guy's still after us. Oh, shit. That guy is literally still after us. Got him. He's still going, though. Oh, that was a neck shot. Fuck's what? sake. Come on. Control pad aiming you. Ooh, fucking swallow that, you dick. Okay. Now we can't open that. I'm actually guessing the combination to that is fairly fairly easy to find. It wasn't the first game. Or the first version. The original. There's the word I'm looking for. Oh, yeah, he's done. He's done. I mean, he's got no head meat left at all. Oh my god, can this game be out already, please? Like, come on, man. Ah, club. Guys, what the fuck? Ah, oh, here we go, look. Welcome, Leon. Yeah, that's, of course, it would have been Leon's desk, which actually had the letter in it originally, if I remember correctly. Operation report. Man, I want to read it. Ah, Actually, we'll put it in the video like this, so if you guys want to read it, you can. And then I'll probably read it whilst I'm editing it back. More bullets. I can see, actually, if you're careless, like I am, you could probably really tear through your ammo. I can't get through there. Can't get through there, so... How do we get back round? So that's... Reception. Ah, we haven't been... Oh, it even greys out like corridors in the same room that you haven't been down. That's really nice. So we haven't been down this corridor and it's... No. So I'm guessing like zombies can constantly... Ooh. Get back up. Unless you've actually um, killed them. Like proper killed them. Like head splodged them. Which I actually really like. I'm a huge fan of that. We'll have that. I'm pretty sure that was uh, a red herb. When we first played it. Which is curious. We obviously can't save it. Let's go develop our film. I oh, know, there's the red herb. Now, can we auto dump those? Yeah, we can. We can dump those straight in. <gasps> Look how good the red herb the herb mix looks. Ooh. Ah, we have missed a toilet somewhere. Uh, did we not grab the film? I don't think we grabbed the film, but it doesn't matter. Do not leave evidence. That's cool. We don't plan on leaving evidence. Uh, more gunpowder. Make some bullets. That's fine. And I think there's bullets in here. Unless it's genuinely RNG, which it is not. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Combine. There we go. 
So ammo definitely stacks, like, in quite a significant way. Yeah. Mm. We won't take that with us. We do need some storage. Let's go. Let's see if this fucking ass tart has come through. Bro. You come through, buddy. You come through. Open invitation, my friend. Now, let's go back down here. Oh, this room's actually kind of different because there was another door here in the original. Which is not here. Now, in Resident Evil 3, this is where Nemesis can uh, make an appearance. Now, apparently, the room Amir was alive at the moment with the fact that they are also remastering RE3. Which, um, yes please. Keep them coming, Capcom. It's going to be nice to have Resident Evil, you know, back to being Resident Evil. Let's drop that down. I don't know if that, like, permanently bars the door. Oh, fuck. Hello. Didn't see you there, Chief. This guy wants it. <gasps> see that cool little animation, then? Oh, you're getting back up. Oh, fuck. These zombies, man. These zombies are tough. They, these zombies feel like they should. You know, th these are no joke. If the brain is intact, then they keep coming. Shit. First female zombie. Oh, throat shot. Oh, God. She's pissed. I'm liking the damage you do to the character models as well. It's so cool. Now, what I want to know... Okay. So, it doesn't appear that you can splodge their heads. When they're on the floor. Which is a shame. Right, so we can go up there. Where else can we go? Ah, this is the toilets, wasn't it? Yeah, we can't go through there. Uh, we probably could guess that if... Oh, yeah, what about you? Why would you be in a locker, sir? I mean, honestly. Unless he was, like, dead. Or injured, and he hid in a locker, and then died in the locker. That's pretty hardcore. What's that on the floor? Ah. That's cool. But we probably should have taken... Probably should have taken our... Um, uh, green herb, to be fair. Right, let's have a little look up here. More bullets. Don't mind if I do. I actually really like the inventory as well. It's actually... Feels very nice. Very nice. Ah, another one of those. Okay. So they're going to be like the thing in this game. Oh, club key. And a mannequin statue type thing. So there's two places we can use that club key. Oh, that was a liquor. That was a liquor. Oh, come to daddy, you son of a bitch. Come on. Come to daddy. Okay, I thought we might be able to destroy that. There's another board there, but I don't think we can take it. Uh, gunpowder. Can't take that. Oh, this place looks cool. Oh, the library. 
Okay. More bullets. Don't mind if I do. Mm. Ooh, C4. Okay, so I guess we need to blow that wall. And what have we got here? Ooh, a hip pouch. So we can increase our... Our, um, carrying capacity. That's nice. Okay, let's go to the library. Hey, Marv. Are you okay, Mark? Alright, buddy. Alright, buddy. Let's go back and see Marv. Now, there should be quite a puzzle in here, but I guess we can't actually do the puzzle. Oh, look at the library. It looks so much more, like, fleshed out. We will actually take another knife. Uh, another knife, yeah. Now, can we open this? We actually can. Oh, that's such a satisfying animation there. And this should bring us straight back out into the main hall. Okay, let's go see Marvin. Now, I wonder if the zombies can actually come out into this main hall. I honestly don't know. There you are. Come here. Take a look. Yes. Hey, you Claire. Oh, you know her? Yeah. Name's Claire. I came into town with her. You can get to that courtyard. Through the second floor. East side. <laughs> I'm on it. Thanks, Lieutenant. Thank you for playing. Now, did we run out of time? No, we completed it. Nice. Okay, so I actually finished the demo. Ah. <sighs> we are going to play it one more time on the Xbox One X. Just go through it a little bit quicker. So, I mean, we could really, because there was that, we could turn around and go back the way we came because there was a, another club door that we can open. So if we be through it rather, rather sprightly like, hmm, maybe, maybe we can make it through that door and find out what's through there. Let's have a look, shall we? Anyway, guys, I hope you're looking forward to this like I am. I I cannot wait for this game. Literally, I cannot actually wait for it. Um, I wish we could play this demo as often as we liked. I mean, even if they gave us two playthroughs. Ah, it's just so cruel to have, to have this set up as a one-shot. But there we are. There the cards were dealt. Hmm... So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks very much for watching. And as always, till next time.